Oh, beautiful. Oh, not beautiful. Right, pop out once, yep. That's not what I want to see. That's not what I want to see. Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from Last Stand Gamers, and welcome. So today, I'm playing a little bit of War Thunder after it was requested by you guys. I thought I'd check it out, give it a go, and I got really into the tank battles. I started taking out some of the bigger oh, tanks, and I'm going to get a little bit of revenge on that SU-152 that took me out before when I was in my smaller T-34. So I've got to come around mate. the back of it, find that weaker angle, and use my speed and maneuverability to take that vehicle out. So I've slid down the side of it, now I've just got to line up a shot and destroy that thing. Oh, I got it! So let's move on. Let's move on to the next target. The is the strongest front, but it's not as well angled. Neither is the side, and I don't know where the ammo rack is on my own tank. So, honestly not sure, Aaron. Do you want me to Rear try armor and side armor are the best bet. That's all I can say. He's not going anywhere. The back of his tractor is So with my friend right, holding the street the in his KV that's severely damaged, I need to get on the flank of this heavy KV tank and try to hit some of that again. weaker armor down the side. So KV's using the speed of the T-34 once again, I'm trying to get that nice side armor on the turret or the, the lower hull and get some into his right chassis and I've take out his crew his members well, and destroy that heavy tank. On yes. fire. Oh, found good, found a good. way in. Found a way in. What is the, what what way? Yeah, I'm doing He's him. He's got in. a lot of friends with him. Just hold, hold. Got him. Got him. Bloody good job. Bombing coming on me. I'm going down. Nice knowing you. Oh no! I right, hit the others. Brilliant. So we're moving up the action Spotted. a little bit in pace here to the KV heavy tank. Spotted. Just hit his ammo. Just hit his ammo. He's still up though. Created him. Yeah, he's down. He's down. Gonna let this uh, SU-152 go here. Some good bits of cover here. Yeah, I've got a really good wreck. I'm worried about that Panther. Where's the Panther? Panther Camp Wagon 5. Uh, there it is. We've got stuff ridging. Artillery fire. We're we going in or we're we going out? Um, I've. All right, well, I'm moving forward. Oh shit, we got a little. We got a trolley. We got a trolley with a cannon on. Look out! Is it me? Someone else down. Got him. He's down. Watch out for the artillery hitting behind us. Left, 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 left. Oh, what the hell's that? He's missed me, I think. Put him on three side. I've been hit. I've been hit. Took him out. Good job. I'm operational still. Alright, good job. We just need to We're hold it, make sure they can get C behind us. Bombs coming in, look out. Bomb! You okay? Yeah, I'm good. But they can, uh, they can crush us if we go up here. So, as We're we move careful. on to this plateau, we discover We're quite a KVs, strange though. situation wow. happening yeah, here. Wow. What's going on a there. tank that has its gun yeah. destroyed. I think we should just move trying to destroy a T-34 right by ramming it into now. a wall. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. And that's one of the physics factors of this game. Heavier tanks, when they hit a smaller tank, it's, be a speed it's just absolutely move. beautiful. Yeah, let's do this guy in. Missed him. Missed him. He's Bounced gone. it. It's on the left. Oh my god, KV-85 to left. Shit. Help me, gunner's dead. Oh yes, 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 the rammer's going in. Yeah. Are we okay? Yeah, we just gotta deal with the 85. I'm gonna try doing me in, I think. think. Oh shit, I just went through his machine gun port. We'll stop him. It's down. Thank god. You will be repaired. Get to see, get to see. 
So in this roll. next scenario, we're back move, in the city. Move, move. We're pushing down one of the main streets with two KVs. The, the KV heavy Fire tanks in. are more of the sort of brawlers that'll take a lot of the brunt of the damage, and yeah. you can actually move them down, use these tanks as the cover for the smaller tanks to flank around and distract the okay. heavier tanks, get them rear flanking Lovely shots down. that are a lot harder to take. Good destroyed. job. He's got a panzer breaking off right. Right, I'm holding up so you can farm back up on me. You ready? Yeah, sure. Have you got a new engine in there? Yeah. <laughs> that way I'm a bit faster. All right, we've got tanks cutting from left side to the right side of the street. Watch that. We've got a Stug also exposing its arse on the right of us. Does he need help with that? I think he does. May as well if you got the shot. His engine's down. Do you want to do his front end? Penetrated, no damage. Oh. Left, left, left. Left is clear. Left is not clear. Left, left, left. Bring oh, no, no, up. no. It's alright, we've got plenty of cover between it. Yeah, just take that uh, Stranger shots. It's dancing a bit, isn't it, that tank? Well, the thing is, like, I mean, people say, oh, critical it. Was that it? Yeah, left oh, now, oh, left, Aaron. Gonna pass. Left needs attention. Bring it around left. There we've got a little baby tank. Don't know what he's doing. Goodbye. Nice job. Yeah. Oh, it's a KV-1, Aaron. No, push up, push up. Out the kill zone. Engage the Lee ahead of us. Hold up, tank. Kill that Lee. Roger. Lee's dead, taking a left. Job. So, as we rounded the corner, we actually Whoa. found out that it was being held by Could both be. a Tiger and a KV-1. Now this was a big problem because these tanks at this angle are absolutely near impossible to penetrate. What made it even further a problem is that we've got a Tiger at the end of the road with its armour tilted perfectly. We've got a Sherman here though that's not too aware and what I've learned from playing this is you need to get as many weapons or many angles covered as possible and if you can take out one of them weapons from firing on you it's going to save you a lot of time. There's no point of dealing with that Tiger at the moment. I've just got to try to get myself as tight as the wall and stay as safe and possibly neutralize its barrel. So the Sherman's actually turned into me now. I finished him off. And we've got the two tanks around the corner. Now from this angle, the only way in is probably through the driver's slit. But getting a shot like that is gonna be close to impossible, so I'm gonna have to bait him out somehow. We've got the tiger up at uh, the end of the road. Too well for me. It's a heavy tank duping it out here. And as you can see its armor is perfectly angled. Oh, so I'm not gonna do any damage. Trying to break its turret. I do spot a weakness now, he's giving his armour straight flat onto the side so I should be able to get a round through him. The track stops it, and I'm looking to get a round wow, between that crew compartment. Side. Oh my god, there's a tiger right in front of me. So here it goes, the hole yes, is presented. Not the tiger. Get the opportunity, penetrate him, hit the side here, yeah. fuel tank, and neutralise the crew. Straight from the driver's hatch. Now the only thing I can actually damage on this tank is its barrel, so I've called in some air support here. Now these planes are available at intervals, and I, I think they were really good. They break a lot of stalemates where a tank is camped this down on a corner. So I've got to spot the tiger, but I'm also tempted by a lot of other targets. Oh, I don't know, Nate. Should I do the tiger or should I do the guys that are flanking us? Tiger. Well, there's the tiger. We've got a target firing their missiles. Got him. There we go, crash the plane. The crane's not really important, you have a Tank limited timer on them. It's keeping your tank alive is the most important part of this. And I move on to neutralize the tanks on the flank of the objective. So we've got a nice Sherman, an easy kill if we can get the rounds through it. All it has to do is turn in, make its armor a little bit flatter for me, like it does. And there we go, enemy kill right, assist. Good him. shot through the ammo rack. But I thought I'd wrap up the gameplay clip with this interesting sort of bit of footage I got. I went back into the replay because I wasn't capturing it at the time. If you notice, the first round actually bounces off my turret and takes out a tank over in the distance. And then he follows up by firing a second shot that damages my gunning compartment, knocks my loader out. And then he decides to do this. I was really surprised by this. He comes behind a 50 ton tank and stops. What was he expecting? with his merely 29 ton T-34, I simply flip him over, turn around, and at this point, my gun's got like 30, 40 second reload time, and you can see the panic in his tracks as he's wiggling them back and forward, just hoping 
like a caged animal for some sort of freedom. And then with a final cannon blast, we're moving from play. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.